Hey, Slick Review fans, coming at you with another video. In this episode, we're checking out two cool new cases from Blackbrook for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Hey everyone, so on this episode, we're checking out two new cases from Blackbrook. These are for the iPhone 15 Pro Max, and they're a little bit different from some of the stuff that we've seen before. So I wanna check out the York first. This one is the Reed. We'll check this out in a second, uh, but this one's the York. So we'll take a look in the box here. Comes in the typical Blackbrook presentation with this nice box. And then they also give you a nice dust bag too. So before we take a look at this, Blackbrook reached out to me and let me know that they also offer image engraving now. Some of the Blackbrook stuff that we've looked at before is only like letters, like initials and your name and stuff like that. We've looked at quite a few products from them where we've done that, but now their engraver does images as well. So I thought, you know, what could we try to do? So on this one, I've got an image of my dog that passed away last year. Um, so I thought if there was a case that I wanted with an image that I was going to see every single day that this is the one I wanted. So I'll give you a nice close up of the image that came out on the case and then what I sent into them. And I think it turned out pretty good, especially considering that again, it's just a laser engraver on leather. And I think it did pretty good converting a color image to black and white and then trying to put it on here. So I'm happy with the results. If you wanted to do something like that, that's what I went with. So I'm glad that I can see my dog every day when I have this case on my phone. Um, but taking a look at the outside of the case here. So again, this is the York for the 15 Pro Max. On the outside here, we have these uh, just rubber bumpers. What I do like is that they're indented on each side and it gives you a little bit more grip. So I do like that. It's got the buttons, including the new action button on the bottom all your normal cutouts. On the side, there is a place for a lanyard. It doesn't come with one, but if you had one, it does have the holes to attach one of those if you wanted. Of course, your power button, and that's pretty much it. So then on the back, again, it's this slab of leather, really nice stitching around the outside, and the leather feels really nice too. This one is a pebble leather, so it has a nice texture to it. I do like it, and the Blackbrook Buffalo logo is stamp down there as well. So it's not really in your face, um, but it is there. So it looks really cool. Let's get it put on the 15 Pro Max. And it does have this nice like microfiber lining on the inside too. So it shouldn't scratch your device or anything. So snaps right on the 15 Pro Max. Feels really good. Let's test out uh, MagSafe compatibility. I've got this uh, power brick that we looked at uh, a few months ago. So this is MagSafe. Yep, attaches right to the phone and charges through the case. So no issues there. So that's the York. Um, now let's move on and take a look at the other one that they sent in. So this one here is the Reed. And this one's got a couple more tricks uh, than the York does. So again, same presentation in the box with the little dust bag here. Uh, so this one is the Reed. So it's a little bit different. Um, it has a very similar kind of construction to the one we just took a look at. Uh, so around the outside, same kind of rubber, you know, everything there is basically identical. It's got the indentations on the side, which I do like for the added grip of it. But what's cool about this one is it's got a built-in kickstand here on the back. And it's got the little Blackbrook logo there. Then when you open it, it says Blackbrook on the side. Um, but what's nice is that this uh, kickstand here, it's not just like open or closed. It's got enough tension that pretty much anywhere past that. And even, yeah, so that's kind of the, the opening part right there. But then anywhere along there, it's got enough tension. You can put it anywhere you want. So what's nice is you can drop it on your phone. We'll get it put on my 15 Pro Max here. And again, it's essentially the same uh, skeleton of this case. Um, so it fits perfectly just like the York did. Uh, but anyway, so the kickstand here, you can put that to wherever you want. Let's do it so it's wide open here. So it's got a nice kind of angle. I don't, I don't know what to say, but like if you were on your lunch break or on a plane or something like that, that's a nice viewing angle, but maybe you want it up a little bit more. So you just tweak the kickstand and you can put it 
pretty much wherever you want. Um, and if you get the angle right, you can even put it, if I can get it there. Yeah, there you go. So you can do it in portrait mode too. So if you're doing an Instagram live or whatever you kids do these days, um, TikToks, <laughs> you could do it with this case. Um, so we did the burnished tan on this one because I do like, especially Blackbrook's uh, burnished tan. I do like that look. Um, we did the logo for, I'm in grad school right now, so we did the logo for my school on the back here. So again, I'll show you up close and then the image I sent in. Now, in full transparency, this one didn't really turn out as crisp and clear as I had hoped. And when they got back to me after they had done them, they did acknowledge that like this one didn't really turn out great, right? The one with my dog turned out, I think, as good as it could. Uh, in this case, like a lot of the details are kind of lost when they converted the color image to black and white. So this one didn't really work as well. So you definitely want to communicate them. I would recommend maybe ahead of time, um, get in touch with them if you want to do an image of any sort. I would get in touch with them ahead of time, maybe send the image in and ask them for their opinion if they think it'll translate well or not to actually being engraved. Um, so again, in full transparency, I don't think the, the image here is necessarily a win. Um, I mean, it looks cool enough, but I think if I had paid $35 for it, I probably would have been a little disappointed um, just because again, a lot of the details are lost. Um, so I tell you that to say, if you're going to do the image engraving, Again, I would recommend getting in touch with them ahead of time to see if whatever image you have is going to work. Um, and it is helpful if you have an image with no background. Um, so cutting out, you know, whatever you don't want to be in the image, like the one of my dog, it was taken in our living room and I was able to use one of just a free app to get rid of the background. So it was just him and sent that in because they take the image, load it in their uh, software and the laser just does it, right? Um, so anyway, I think this one didn't really turn out as good. The one with my dog turned out a lot better. Uh, so the leather on the reed, this one's a nice smooth leather compared to the pebble leather that we had on the York. Um, so a nice burnished tan, smooth leather. I do like the kickstand in that you can put it pretty much wherever you want. I think that's really cool. Now let's get MagSafe, make sure that that works. So let's grab my wireless power bank and yeah, there we go. Charging through the case with MagSafe. So no issues there either. So that is the York and the Reed case from Blackbrook. These are for the 15 Pro Max. Like usual, they have a ton of different colors. So it's not just the two we have to look at. This one is sand and this one is burnished tan. So definitely go to their website. The link is down below. But what I'd like to know from you all is what image would you put on your phone case? So one more time, the options that you have are either embossing with letters, that's $25. If you wanna see an example of that, I'm gonna have a couple uh, other Blackbrook videos at the end of this video. And one of those with their wallet folio case features the embossed initials. So if you wanna see what that looks like, that one's 25 bucks. Make sure to watch that other video at the end, but the laser engraving is 35 and that you can also do text or an image or you know within reason, kind of whatever you want. So get in touch with them and see if what you have in mind is gonna work. Um, but what I'd like to know from you all is what are you gonna put on your Blackbrook phone case? You're gonna do an image. I, again, really like this one of my dog. I miss him a lot. Um, but what would you guys put on your phone case? Let us know down in the comments. If you have any other comments or questions, please leave them down below. I like to hear from everybody. And if you'd like to get in touch, all my social media links are down in the description as well. And last, before we go, if you enjoy straightforward, to the point content like this, where we find great deals online from well-known and upcoming brands, make sure to leave the video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Pretty easy and free ways to help support the channel. That's all I've got for you this time. I'm Zach, this is Slick Reviews, and I'll see you in the next video. This review is completed following several weeks for the product sample provided by the manufacturer. No compensation was provided and the manufacturer was not allowed editorial input, copy approval, or an early preview. To see more videos like this, please consider subscribing to the channel.